Levinson is very disappointing. Indeed, he doesn't really go into the detail that was really necessary, uh, but he's making vague remarks about the need for future transparency, etc., etc. So press ownership is an unresolved issue in the Levinson report. What Levinson introduces is a highly credible system of self-regulation with various penalties for people who don't cooperate. But what's controversial is his suggestion that this be underpinned by statutory regulation. But what he's talking about isn't regulation of the press by the state. He's talking about giving the press an opportunity to regulate it itself with the backing of law in public perception of how it's doing its duties and with the knowledge also that it really does have backing behind its, its own suggestions for correcting the misconduct of the press. So I think on the whole it's a very good report, although I'm highly critical of the fact that it seems to accept the present level of media concentration and that present level of media concentration is one of the reasons why the phone hacking scandal erupted in the first place. Why? Because the politicians were scared of News International. And News International was scared of nobody.